Okay, this video is about how to get Microsoft Office onto your MacBook with the M1 chip. I'm not actually going to download it or demonstrate a download, but I'll show you how to access it or get to it. So I just tapped on the App Store app down here, and let's say you have a Microsoft Office subscription. For, uh, it's called 365 subscription. So yeah, there you go. Enter. And then there it is. So you can click view, check out some information about it. Um, and you would click get. When you get, uh, you're basically downloading all these apps that are part of the subscription suite. And there's actually more than just these four. Uh, there's also Microsoft OneNote and OneDrive. But maybe you don't want all these. Maybe you want to download individual ones, which you can do. You can click get for any one of these, or if you want all of them, just tap get here. Now, once it's on your machine, you probably are not gonna be able to use any of these apps unless you enter your username and password from Microsoft. So I'm kind of thinking there will be a window that'll pop up and Microsoft will prompt you to enter your username and password so you can enjoy that subscription service on this machine. If you do get some kind of a uh, window that pops up about Apple Silicon. Um, that is the one you would want if you have an M1 processor in your machine. If you, for whatever reason, did not download that version, if it's the standard Intel optimized version, then um, I think when you do app updates for these, it should automatically update to the M1 version. Um, so that's how you access that. You could go to office.com and download from there, but I think there's an extra step that involves taking the newly downloaded apps and drop dropping them, dragging and dropping them into a applications folder on your machine. So it's a little bit of an extra step, and I think this is a little bit easier, a little bit more seamless. So I hope that's helpful. And uh, if uh, you have any comments you want to enter in, in the comment section below, please go ahead. Thank you.